Welcome to Al May. We are here to share tech knowledge with you. Let's get our journey started. Today we are going to talk about how to fix MBR to GPT validation failed in Windows 10. We have two parts in this video. Part 1. Causes and solutions to MBR to GPT validation failed. Part 2. Quick fixes to MBR to GPT validation failed with Dami Partition Assistant. Let's move to part 1 to see why it failed and the corresponding solutions. Here I'm going to show you two possible causes for MBR to GPT validation failed and corresponding solutions. Reason 1. Inapplicable Windows System. MBR to GPT program only applies to Windows 10 version, 1703 or later version. An applicable Windows system can lead to MBR to GPT disk layout failed. Solution If you're using a computer running Windows 7, 8, or 8.1, please upgrade the operating system to Windows 10. If you have installed earlier versions of Windows 10, you must run the tool while booting into Windows 10 version 1703 or later and perform an offline conversion. Reason 2 Non System Disk MBR to GPT can convert any attached MBR formatted system disk to the GPT partition format. You cannot use it to convert non-system disks from MBR to GPT. Solution If you do want to convert a data disk, you can convert MBR to GPT in Windows 10 via disk management or disk part. Attention! You are at a risk of losing data in this way because you have to delete all partitions or volumes on the disk before conversion. If you are looking for a way to get rid of the version limits and risks of data loss, you can't miss this powerful MBR to GPT alternative. It can let you easily convert MBR to GPT without the above mentioned problems. You can Google Ame Partition Assistant, download and install it. Let's turn to part 2 and see how it works. Click Alme Partition Assistant and get into the home page of it. You can see your disks and their information here. With the help of Alme Partition Assistant, you can convert no matter system disk or data disk to GPT. Here I choose disk 3 as an example. It is a data disk. Right click on it and select convert to GPT. Next, if you are sure to do this, then click OK and hit apply. Finally, click proceed. Now you can see disk 3 has converted to GPT disk successfully. If you want to convert the system disk, just do the same steps as we did before. You should make sure your computer motherboard supports EFI or UEFI mode. Once you convert it to GPT, you have to change the boot mode to UEFI in BIOS. That is all about how to fix MBR to GPT validation failed in Windows 10. Hope you can get what you need after watching this video. Want to know more about Alme? Looking for more tech knowledge? Just subscribe us and leave comments. We are here to help you with any questions.